I saw we saw with the the celebrations on Saturday what it meant to to the players the win. But how important is it? And do you now feel that you you have fully turned the corner? Yeah, I think so. But, uh, I think it was much more important the game against uh, Cardiff uh, last uh, Tuesday because uh, it was the game which uh, changed everything because it was a, a difficult game and now the team again is uh, more confident, is uh, better on the on the pitch and I said after uh, NK Downs and after Leeds that if we had played in the way that we played all those games uh, we were going to start winning games so for the reason I am pleased because the team again is consistent on the on the pitch, uh, they are confident and uh, you know when we have the quality that we have on the pitch, it's, uh, it's easier. Do you think the, the signings, the January signings, uh, have made a big difference? I think so, because uh, all of them are really good uh, players, all of them are uh, experienced uh, players, as that uh, Julian uh, Kike Sola played in Spain in La Liga, Richie Dolar in Premier League, Jordan Rhodes, uh, a lot of games in in championship, a lot of goals, last time I made it, uh, play the, the World Cup, so all of them are experienced players, all of them are uh, hungry players, so I'm really pleased because again we are uh, winning the games and uh, we have uh, good fixtures now to, to keep going. Jose Mourinho was at the game on, on Saturday, did you speak to him? Yeah. What did he have to say? Oh, I was uh, happy because uh, we we uh, we had won the the game and now he's uh, he's enjoying he's uh, visiting his his friends so he's happy. Any hints about his future? No. <laughs> when I speak with him, I always speaking about uh, our families, our friends, because uh, I know I know, I don't know anything and uh, I don't want to know because everybody's asking me. So for reason I prefer to not uh, know anything. The game. Tomorrow night is the game in hand. How important is it to win that game and, and to get back to the top of the table? It's really important because, uh, you know, uh, always we are looking at the table and um, everybody is thinking that uh, Middlesbrough has uh, one or two games uh, on hand, in hand. So, for example, now this is the, the first game. So, for is uh, it's important. But uh, it's important to win this game because it's the game that we have uh, less than the other teams. And it's important because we are in a in a good run, we haven't lost uh, a game in February, so it's important to, to keep going. Jordan Rose was on the bench on Saturday. Are you happy with the way that he's adjusted to life up here on Seaside? The way that he's settled in? Yeah, because uh, he's the first who who knows that uh, he's training in a completely different way, he's playing in a completely different way and always take, uh, take time. We are really pleased with uh, him, I especially am really pleased with him because everybody was expecting goals from him and uh, he had chances and he hadn't um, scored last, last, uh, those uh, chances but he's working really good for the, for the team, the team is uh, winning games of our reason I'm really pleased with him and he understands perfectly his, uh, his situation. Players often score against their, their former club so do you factor that into your thinking when you pick the team to face Blackburn, his former club, is the script written for him to score the winning goal? Yeah, but he can play one minute to score the, the winning goal, so it's, uh, in this league it's 94, 95, 96 minutes, so I have to, to think because I have an amazing the squad and I have to think about the, the team and about the, the squad. Jordi Gomez scored a couple of goals for, for Blackburn at the weekend, they played really well at, at Derby, got a good win on, on Saturday, are you expecting it to be a really tough game? Yes, and uh, it was here when we played against them and uh, they played uh, really well against uh, us. We we draw that uh, drew that uh, that game, but it was really really difficult because uh, they played really well. And uh, Jordi is a really good player, uh, Premier League experience, so he's making the the difference uh, there. For reason, we have to to be careful with with him. A lot of fixtures coming up. Does that make it difficult for you as head coach to? to pick your team and to, to plan things for the next couple of weeks or is it the championship and you're used to it by now? Yeah, but I think it's, uh, it's better for, uh, for me and for, uh, for us because when uh, you have the squad who, which I have now, it's better to have games every single two or three days because I have uh, enough players to, to change and uh, with a lot of good players, all of them expecting to, to play, it's, uh, it's better for me to give them the chance every three or four days. Thank you. I saw what's Jordan said about the game tomorrow night, is he desperate to play? 
a player always is desperate to play. But uh, again, he understands his uh, his role, his uh, his situation, and uh, I know for sure he's dreaming with uh, the score, scoring the the winning goal. But uh, again, he will be happy if uh, he doesn't score and uh, the team win the the game because his his aim is uh, as our aim to to get promotion. He knows that Blackburn defence inside and out. They know his game inside and out. So who's better off, him or them? Sorry. Obviously, they, they know him well, they know how he plays, he knows how that defence plays, so who's better off, Jordan Rhodes or the Blackburn defence? I think Jordan, because he's my player. And uh, he knows uh, then, he he knows uh, his, uh, their uh, weaknesses, and uh, a player like uh, Jordan always is, uh, is dangerous. But let's see tomorrow if uh, Jordan plays or doesn't play, or who's going to play. With it now getting to the business end of the season, how important is it to get a result against Blackburn to keep pace with the other teams up there? It's really important because uh, I said it's the the game that we had uh, we have in hand. So everybody is expecting this game to for me to to play the same game as the the rest of the teams. And for a reason, it's important to play the same game as the most of the teams in the in the championship. And it's three points that we have to to try to add because uh, we're in a good run now. When you look at the table now. As it stands, do you think it will be two of that top five get automatic promotion, or or do you think Derby and Chef Wed are still in there? I think uh, Chef is difficult. They have a really good team. They have a, a good coach, and they've spent uh, good money, so they have a a really good team. But uh, I think uh, it's going to be between uh, our uh, three and uh, and Derby. But uh, can be that the uh, can be that the uh, Chef will. Can can right because again this league is, uh, is crazy. For example, last season uh, in the feature uh, 34 derby was at, top, at the at the top, and uh, at the end they didn't play the, the playoffs. So in this league is uh, and this one thing that they uh, learned in the in this league is to play every single game, thinking just about that uh, that game. And just finally, injury wise, how are you ahead of the game? All of us are ready. Start uh, Danny. Because he's not running, he's not uh, turning with the team, and I think the rest of the players are, are ready.